It is wonderful to see so many American friends here this evening. Governor Murphy, thank you for joining us from across the Hudson River. And Deputy Speaker Murkerji of the New Jersey General Assembly. Where are you? Okay. Would you say hello to the media? A lot of New Jersey government here, but we're in New York City. And uh, New York State and Senate, um, <coughs> Senator Yi Wen Chu. <laughs> and great to have you with us all as well. And, and thank you uh, for coming uh, to this gathering. I'm so pleased to stop over here in the United States on my way to Guatemala and Belize. And to have the honor of seeing all of you here tonight. The enthusiasm of the Taiwanese American community always impresses me. The bond between Taiwan and the United States is strong today. Not only because of our common values and shared interests, but also because of the dedication of so many Taiwanese Americans in bridging this relationship. The Taiwanese people have been incredibly resilient, creating a beacon of democracy in Asia and a robust economy that is an indispensable part of global technology advances. generous citizens that have acted as a force for good in the world, always looking for ways to contribute. At this juncture, our partnerships with the United States and other democracies are more critical than ever. I do need to remind you of the tremendous challenges that we face. And in facing these challenges, we know that we are stronger when we stand together in solidarity with fellow democracies. <laughs> cannot be isolated, and we do not take friendship for granted. We are thankful to all those who stand with us, and we are confident that Taiwan will continue to stand tall, free, democratic, and with dignity. Now, uh, woman, uh, 